Hello, my name is Alia and I'm a trainee pharmacist currently training with Boots in York. Um, I first encountered research around artificial intelligence during my fourth year of pharmacy school at Newcastle University, where I carried a systematic review for my master's degree. Alongside my supervisors, we produced a systematic review to identify an optimal set of non-invasive predictors used to train machine learning algorithms to predict the onset of mild cognitive impairment in cognitively healthy individuals. As you can see in figure one, four databases were used to run the search, where a total of 1,098 papers were retrieved. All titles were screened against the inclusion and exclusion criteria Abstracts and full texts were then again uh, screened against the inclusion and exclusion criteria as well. Our main focus here was to find research that used inexpensive and non-invasive mild cognitive impairment diagnostic methods. Therefore, all research that used neuroimaging, genetics and blood biomarkers were excluded as presented in figure one. Any research that included other uh, medical conditions such as uh, Parkinson's disease were excluded as well. Our findings convey that simple factors present in individuals' daily life, including voice, speech, and gait parameters, and cognitive tests, such as the mini mental state exam can be used as predictors of mild cognitive impairment in cognitively healthy individuals to produce information that had no significant difference to expensive and invasive predictors such as the PET scans. Therefore, reducing the cost of mild cognitive impairment diagnostic methods and reducing the burden on specialists that need to review scan images to make the diagnosis, and also expanding the availability of simple diagnostic tools to more individuals, helping to predict mild cognitive impairment and allowing for earlier diagnosis, which gives individuals time to make medical plans for their future.